drive up your curiosity. I mean, it's here. The one speed, luxury, reliability, comfort, space, all in one in the new BMW X5 M60i X Drive. Let's step inside on luxury, which is a keyless entry. You're welcome by this new upgraded multi functioning steering wheel with stitching, KV White iDrive head screen with Bluetooth, Android Auto, and Apple CarPlay, ambient lighting, two cup holders front and back, wireless charging, automatic AC. M Sport bucket seats wrapped with merino black leathering, topped with a slide or tilt Panamerix and roof. Crystal gear shift, front and rear armrest, Isofix child seat mounting protected by a roller sun blade for both rear windows. Believe me, that's just the tip of the iceberg. Let's advance to reliability, like the Kaisol's adaptive. Okay, let's talk about adaptive M suspensions on 21 inch M performance alloy wheels, 6 airbags, and a tire pressure monitor. Lane departure and blind spot warning with adaptive cruise control and a powerful but yet efficient engine on 240mm ground clearance. It rocks a 4.4 litre V8 petrol turbocharged engine producing 390 kilowatts of power and 715 Nm of torque going from 0 to 100 km in just 4.3 seconds. Just amazing! Sipping 11.9 litres per 100 km driven on a 83 litre tank with range up to 698 kilometers. This, this thing is, is efficient, I don't wanna lie. And that X-Drive badging means it drives on four wheels, makes into 250 kilometers per hour on a speed automatic transmission. It seeks attention with this mid black wheel with M badging, functional vents, revised LED headlights and LED daytime running lights. Slick design owing to its aerodynamic first time M mirror caps with 360 cam, Three dimensional LED tail light and a high level brake light. M Sport exhaust system, electric tailgate that split two ways, offering a pool space of 650 liters and 1870 liters on folded seat. It's priced at 2,283,213 with a warranty plan of two years and unlimited mileage and a maintenance plan of five years, which is 100,000 kilometers. I'm heading out for now. Any question, leave it in the comment section and tell me which car should I do next. Peace.